Okay, this is how I converted my mini wood lathe to a metal lathe. So I've got this four inch milling vise right here. And then I put this piece of wood inside the milling vise with a metal lathe cutter in it. Then I mounted, if you can see right in there, there's a piece of wood that runs all across the metal lathe. And I just bolted it down so the vise will stay in. So let me show you a little bit more in depth. So if we unclamp this, I cut this little notch where I can put the cutter in. And then I have these screws which will let me adjust the height of the cutter. Let's put this back in. And so basically what that allows me to do is when I cut it, it wasn't quite perfect with the chuck. Like alignment wise, I want to say it's pretty decent right now. But if we get it as close as we can, is pretty darn close yeah and another thing another modification I did is I drilled a hole right in here so basically you get your rod put it in and then what we're gonna do we're gonna get our this is what we use to tighten the chuck put that right in there so basically when I turn this, that will pretty much tighten up our chuck. Instead of getting two of those keys, getting it in, having one fall halfway through. Yeah, it's just a lot easier. Right, and one last thing about this wood lathe conversion is this chuck I got on Amazon for about $60. And this is a Moore's Tapper 2. So I can't, unfortunately I can't fit anything through the end of this because it blocks it. It's this nice little three inch chuck you can put in, take out whenever you want if you want to convert it back to a wood lathe. So that's the advantage with that. Eventually I would like to get a thread on chuck. This is a one inch by eight inch TPI. Yeah, just put the tailstock up if I ever need to cut any metal, I can do it.